This is the largest coalition uh, against terrorism uh, the world has uh, ever seen, bringing together countries from the region uh, around the world. So I think it's a great responsibility. Italy has assured its uh, resolute support uh, to the international coalition against Daesh, Daesh particularly uh, through its carabinieri. Italy is leading the coalition strategic initiative of training hundreds uh, of Iraqi police uh, forces. I think it's very important because uh, this is the signal uh, of a very friendship in, uh, for the citizens, for the women, children, for the families of the uh, Iraqi people. Italy has taken the helm also, together with the United States of America and the Saudi uh, Arabia, of the counter ISIL finance group. And uh, it's very important uh, underlying some of initiatives uh, in, uh, in, this, uh, in this sector, the new financial sanction. Uh, the initiative particularly for the restrictive measures also in our country for self-trained jihadist and foreign terrorist fighters. I think this is a particular but uh, very important. And also we are asking coalition partners to focus on external donation in order to prevent terrorist abuse on non-profit organization in Europe. A number of large networks of individuals recruiting foreign terrorist fighters have been discovered and suppressed in recent months, exactly follow the money trail, as proven never so true and never so useful. This is important for me. Just four brief remarks. First, culture. I'm really surprised. Because a lot of attacks are against the museum, Bardo, in Tunisia, against uh, Palmyra, against uh, school in Peshawar and in other countries. So culture is our identity. Italy is leading the efforts uh, with UNESCO to defend also this part of, uh, of this field of uh, uh, discussion. Second, religious. And uh, we think uh, Middle, uh, Middle East today is, I, I, I use this expression, today is and not today was, an incredible and unique cultural and social mosaic for every religion. We must defend particularly in this moment, in, 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 the, in the land in which a lot of religious was born, were born in, in the past. Third, not only Syria, not only Iraqi, but also Africa. Uh, for us, for Italians, obviously, priority is Libya situation, we know, but also the sub saharan um, situation in Africa, particularly with a few rouge who combine together a lot of different extremists. And for my personal consideration, I, I listened yesterday your consideration, Mr. President, about social network, and I agree, obviously. Uh, totally with you, social network is the place of freedom, is an incredible opportunity, and uh, the people arrive, and I, I very appreciated the words of Barack Obama yesterday about it. Obviously, everyone uh, uh, is worried for the risks also of social media and social network as a, a way of recruiting uh, of uh, new terrorists, particularly in uh, our continent, in Europe, uh, in which uh, self-trained jihadists uh, uh, decide to uh, make some in in intervention and in terrorist attack exactly with this uh, approach. But I think it's very interesting, uh, your initiative, um, as the United States and the United Nations, because uh, uh, the risk for a politician, this is my point of view, is to reduce in the time, in the, in, in the season of social network, in the season of old news, in the season of the uh, dominance of uh, a newspaper and the social media, to reduce our vision to all the news, the last news, the last, uh, the, 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 the last press agency, the risk to approach this great uh, question without a comprehensive and say a global approach. I think your initiative of today it's particularly important because uh, help us to have an approach not only focused on the last event of the last news of the uh, last question in the uh, TV, in the old news, but we have a strategy and a vision. And I think this is absolutely crucial because the largest coalition around the world 
must win this battle. So I wish to offer to President Obama Italy's support to an international counterterrorism clearinghouse mechanism, and uh, we are absolutely sure we will prevail and defeat uh, Daesh's evil projects.